Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell the solution of fifth problem from exercise 13.3 from NCRT from surface areas and volumes class 10. A container shaped like a right circular cylinder having diameter 12 centimeters and height 15 centimeters is full of ice cream. The ice cream is to be filled into cones of height 12 centimeters and diameter 6 centimeters having a hemispherical shape on the top. Find the number of such cones which can be filled with the ice cream. So here this is the right circular cylinder which is full of ice cream and the di diameter of this uh, cylinder is given that is 12 centimeters. So diameter of this cylinder is 12 centimeters. Therefore radius of the cylinder R1 is equal to diameter by 2 that is 6 centimeters and height of the cylinder H1 is equal to 15 centimeters. And this ice cream is to be filled into cones of height 12 centimeters and diameter 6 centimeters. So here, these are the ice cream cones. The dimensions of the ice cream cone are, this is the diameter that is 6 centimeters. So diameter of the ice cream cone is equal to 6 centimeters. Therefore, radius of the cone R2 is equal to diameter by 2, 6 by 2, that is equal to 3 centimeters. So this is the radius. And height of the cone, this is the height of the cone H2 that is equal to 12 centimeters. So here uh, this cone includes this hemispherical shape also. See here, uh, it is having a hemispherical shape on the top. So this, this height is excluding this uh, hemispherical shape. So the height of the cone is 12 centimeters. And here the, uh, the radius of this hemispherical shape as well as this cone is same that is 3 centimeters. So here radius of the hemisphere R2 is equal to 3 centimeters and cone is also 3 centimeters. So here R2 is same. And uh, here we have to find the number of such cones which can be filled with ice cream. So let the number of ice cream cones is equal to N. Then you can see here, this ice cream is filled with this number of, let the number of uh, cones be N. Then these are the uh, cones which can be filled with this ice cream that is uh, in the cylinder, in the cylinder, right circular cylinder. So here the volume of the cylinder is equal to N into volume of this ice cream cone. This ice cream cone includes volume of the cone. This is the cone plus volume of the hemisphere. So you have to add both. Then volume of the cylinder is pi R1 square H1 that is equal to N into here volume of the cone is one third pi r2 square h2 plus volume of the hemisphere is two thirds pi r2 cube because here r2 is same radius is same here. So you can see the measurements here from these figures and if you apply these measurements here you can cancel pi and pi you can take out one third pi pi is uh, common here one third pi and r2 square is also common so you can take out here n into one third pi r2 square into here h2 plus 2 r2 therefore n is equal to here if you take uh, take out this 3 here then 3 into r1 square h1 by here r2 square into h2 plus 2 r2 then apply the values here. Here 3 into R1 is, see here R1 is 3 centimeters and height is 15 centimeters. So 6 square into 15 by here R2 is 3 centimeters. See here 3 square into H2 is 12 centimeters. 12 plus 2 into radius is 3 centimeters. R2 is 3. So cancel 3 and 3 here. Then one more 3 here. So 6 square, you can write as 6 into 6 into 15 by 3 into 12 plus 2, 3 are 6. 6 plus 12 is 18. Then 3 ones are, then 6 ones are 6, uh, 3s are 18. And 3 ones are 3, 2s are 6. Then 3 ones are 3, 5s are 15. Then 5 into 2 is 10. Therefore, number of ice cream cones n is equal to 10. Now, please do this similar question. Here, the height of the toy is 12 centimeters. That is uh, including this hemisphere. So you have to subtract uh, 12, uh, 3 centimeters from this 12 centimeters. Then you will get the height of the cone. So height of the cone is 12 minus 3. And uh, hemisphere radius and cone's radius is same. That is 3 centimeters.